Welcome back. Every once in a while, there's a story that comes along and changes the way we look at life. For me personally, this is one of those stories. Jay Spencer is a student at St. John Paul here in Huntsville. He's a football player, a wrestler. Matter of fact, he won the wrestling state title yesterday. You may be wondering what's so great about this story. Well, he's achieving all of these accomplishments while being legally blind. <laughs> probably the hardest working wrestler I've coached in, in 25 years. High school senior Jay Spencer can now call himself a state champion. On Saturday, he captured the 1A to 5A 160-pound state wrestling title in Alabama. But this feat didn't come easy because when Jay was three years old, he was diagnosed with the retinal degenerative disease, which made him legally blind. Jay has never let uh, any type of impairment that he may you may seem he has uh, he doesn't let it affect uh, him on the mat. Jay began wrestling when he was about five or six years old. He attended middle school in Virginia, where he first teamed up with Coach Duke Labossi in the seventh grade. Jay moved to Alabama his sophomore year of high school, and around the same time, Coach Labossi did as well. After looking for a wrestling program, Jay's father asked Coach if he could start one at St. John Paul. He puts in work on the mat in practice on his own personal time, and his, his work ethics on really uncomparable. Jay and Coach Labossi built the program from the ground up and what started with just three wrestlers now has around 25 and this weekend they made history. I just knew that this is my year I can I can win it. With that win Jay became the first wrestler in school history to win a state title once again proving that there truly are no limits. Uh, what's the message you want to send to everyone out there? That don't let what anyone thinks about you change how you think as long as if you believe you can do something, then you can. Man, what an inspiration you are to us all, Jay. I mentioned earlier he's a football player. He played center at St. John Paul. And his coach was just telling me how incredible his work ethic is. Like, he's doing a lot of things just on his own. And, I mean, it's really just a testament to that. You really can do anything that you put your mind to. All his coaches, his friends, right. his family just say, not only is he an amazing athlete, as you saw, but just an amazing student and person as well. And I just I love hearing that. And fun fact, his teammate, Jerry McCarron, he also won as well. So two state title winners, first ever school history. Not a bad situation. Congratulations to those champions. Speaking the champions. Let's take a look at some of the other state wrestling winners before we head to break right here on WZDX Sports Extra.